G'day guys, welcome back to the channel. Well, as you can see in front of me, I have another ZD Racing product here. This is the Pirates 2 BX-8 buggy. It's a 1.8 scale buggy and it also goes under the model number 9072 here. This is another reader run package. As always with ZD Racing, you get everything included. All you have to do is charge the batteries and uh, off you go and just add some batteries to the transmitter, obviously. Um, this one runs a Dumbo RC. There's a bit of glare on the screen there. The uh, Dumbo RC controller once again. And uh, yeah, one eight scale reader run, electric full drive buggy. So um, this came in from Banggood guys for review. Uh, I believe this model's been around for a while because it is a Pirates 2. I believe they've got the new uh, Pirates 3 out. Uh, besides, you know, the body shell and I think they it's got different tyres. I don't think there's much difference between the two. Um, but I think the prices differ quite a bit between the Pirates 3 and this one. But, uh, yeah, let's have a look at some of the specifications. I'll bring it closer to the camera here. We have independent oil-filled shocks. They're Fairly big bore size shocks here. All aluminum chassis here, so it's gonna be pretty durable. Uh, it's got a 25C, it's saying, 11.1 volt, which is a 3S LiPo here, 3000 milliamp hour. Programmable 80 amp ESC, just there. Now I believe these ESCs can handle up to 4S. I actually bought one uh, recently for one of my uh, projects um from ebay and it did state it's the same esc as this it did state two to four s uh, capable the motor here is another brushless motor it's a 3660 can with a 2400 uh, kv motor okay and uh yeah guys we can get it in a couple of colors as you can see here here is the other one i believe that's a pirate 3 though um yeah it is there's an advertisement here, Pirates 3 BX8E. So this is the newer model there. They've advertised it on this box as well, okay? So as you can see, it's got different uh, different wheels here, um, different tires, and uh, different body styling, okay? All right, guys, so let's take it out of the box, have a quick look, and uh, see what we okay, get. Guys, I've got everything out of the box. So first off, we get the user manual. Now, I'm not going to open this, guys, but it's going to have all the information you need to know. Uh, we'll have exploded diagrams, all the parts lists at the back with the part numbers. Um, we also got two zip ties here, a couple of 3M pads here, just in case the ESC becomes loose with sand and grit when you go bashing with it. You've got a, a fresh uh, set of uh, sticky pads there. And these are little servo um, adapters. So if you decide to change to a servo later on down the track, you've got different adapters to suit the stock steer steering servo horn, okay? Also get a quick start guide leaflet for the Dumbo RC controller as well. It just folds out. It's in English and Chinese. Okay, quick start guide for the controller. Now the controller is a Dumbo RC controller. Uh, it's not Dumbo RC branded. It is got the ZD Racing labeling, but as you can see, it's pretty much a Dumbo RC TX. Now these are awesome guys. ZD Racing, uh, props to them for including them with all their reader run cars now and trucks. They've been doing it for the last couple of years and uh, it's a huge upgrade to the transmitters that they used to have, okay? Uh, it's a, basically a four or five channel remote here. Um, got different switches on the side, a button here for auxiliaries. On and off, you got a nice plastic wheel, even though it doesn't have any foam. It is a very responsive uh, control here. Good grip with these indentations anyway. Uh, and underneath this lid here, we've got all our steering trim, steering drill rate, throttle trim, throttle drill rate, and reverse switches, okay? It's even got a USB or micro USB uh, import, uh, input here and a three millimeter jack. So you could probably use this on your computer as well. And it takes your standard four AA batteries as well, okay? Range on this is about 500 meters, four or 500 meters, okay? Comes with this uh, IMAX RC uh, 
B3 charger here, guys. Uh, great little charger. I'm not going to open this up. I've covered it in many other ZD Racing uh, RC videos that I've done. Uh, I highly recommend that you use a hobby grade charger if you've got one laying around. I personally don't use these anymore, but I used to. And these ones do do a great job of uh, balancing your batteries. As you can see here, it also has a 2S and 3S uh, balance port there. And yeah, these do charge your batteries pretty good. So uh, yeah, I love how they always uh, include these chargers within their uh, RC Reach Run kits. Lastly, in this bag, we have the large 1.8 scale wing here. It's got a couple of spaces there. Okay, and the screws and bolts to uh, put the wing on the back. As you can see, the wing isn't on at the moment. Okay, guys, I went and put the rear wing on. You just have to put a couple of these uh, screws in there. And on the underside, you've got some little nylock nuts just there. Okay, so you're going to need like your tool wrench for the wheels to put on the underside as you screw in those top uh, screws for the, the spoiler. As you can see, it's a rather large spoiler there. Um, very nice shockies on this one, guys, as you can see. Nice all-filled shocks. This has big bore shocks all around. Okay, you can adjust the preload as well. Okay, we've got sway bars on the front here, just there. In the front and on the rear. It's got the anti-roll sway bars okay and what i like on this one too just at first glance look how thick these uh turnbuckles are these tie rod ends guys they're fully adjustable as well uh, we've got a nice thick shock tower here as well let me just take the body shell off retaking the pins off okay so we've got the nice pirates 2 1 8 scale rtr Pose 2 BX8 body shell. Okay, nice Lexan shell there. See, as I was saying, guys, got some thick, rather thick uh, shock towers front and rear. There's the rear one. All right. Uh, we've got some. Reinforcement uh, chassis braces that go from the body post down on the front and the rear as well. You can see on this second level uh, plate here, we've got another brace that goes down and bolts onto the actual aluminum chassis. There's a two piece tail shaft, just there, two pieces, and it's uh, in the center. We've got a center diff, just in the middle there. An integrated spur and there is the motor now this motor is a 3660 and it's set on the box 2400 kv all right got the brushless esc just here as well dean's plug as always with zd racing we've got the dean's plug but yeah guys pretty heavy duty looking rc car here it's got some good weight to it underneath Got the all aluminum chassis plate and no Phillips heads to be seen. It's all hex heads or Allen key head screws. So that's really good. Okay. Got some nice tires here as well. Very soft compound and very grippy 1 8 scale buggy tires. I really do like these wheels too. They look like a 12 spoke, 10 or 12 spoke white wheel with the large hexes there locking nuts on this side we have the receiver box it's above the servo here i don't know what kilogram servo this is but it's really quiet i'll put that up on the screen uh what uh, kilogram servo this is and we have the 3s lipo battery so let's have a look at that got some uh three velcro tabs here okay and the battery that we get with it is a 3000 milliamp hour 11.1 volts a 3s 35c discharge lipo 
actually said 25C on the box, so there you go. 35C LiPo, pretty decent size, it's a soft pack. So that's what we get. All right, guys, well, that's basically it on this uh, one. Um, what I'll do, I'll charge that battery up, and uh, what I might do is just save that for a, a, a part two video. Uh, we'll take it out and see how it, how it performs, okay, guys? So thanks for watching this quick overview on the uh, Pirates 2. This is the BX-8, okay, also known as the... 9072 scale buggy from ZD Racing. Um, they do claim on the box too, I forgot to mention that it has a top speed of around 50 mile an hour or 80 k's an hour. So I'll definitely be checking out the top speed on this one later on as well. So stay tuned for those videos guys, okay? Uh, there'll be links to Banggood uh, in the description below for this one and I'll also include a coupon code that they provide me. So if you're interested in this one, having a look at least, click the link below and uh, have a look at this uh, awesome 1.8 scale buggy. I look forward to running it and uh, we'll see how it performs with the uh, stock battery provided. All right, guys? So uh, thanks very much once again. If you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff. And I'll catch you on the next one. All right, guys. Bye for now.